Have you ever seen chickens in your neighborhood? <laughs> Just last week, I looked out my front window and I noticed there were a couple of chickens roaming my cul-de-sac. But are you even allowed to have chickens in Palm Harbor? As you can imagine, I was pretty surprised when I looked out my window and I saw a couple of chickens roaming my neighbor's yard. It's not something you see very often in urban and suburban areas. And in fact, in nearly 13 years of selling real estate, I've only ever been asked the question one time. So is it even allowed or is my neighbor violating city and or county ordinances? As usual, different cities have different laws and ordinances. So make sure you check for your location first. But Palm Harbor is considered unincorporated Pinellas County, and therefore we fall under Pinellas County laws and ordinances when it comes to keeping chickens. So for Pinellas County, for residential properties, there are a number of rules that you have to comply with. First, you may actually have up to four hens at the property. No roosters, of course we don't want to hear that at five or six o'clock in the morning. So hens only, and you can have a maximum of four. The second stipulation is that you cannot keep chickens for any commercial purpose or for slaughter at a residential property. Third, and this is pretty common sense and I'm sure the rest of us are pretty happy for this one, is that to keep chickens they cannot be a nuisance. So that includes noise, hence no roosters, odors, so you've got to keep everything clean, and any pests that might come around because you're keeping chickens on the property. Fourth, chickens must be kept in the backyard in a securely fenced area that is safe from predators. Number five, chicken coops must be kept clean and they must be located a minimum of 10 feet away from your neighbor's property. On top of that, they are also not allowed to be seen from your neighbor's property. They can only be six feet tall and they need to be secured and enclosed either by a privacy fence or some kind of screening that prevents your neighbors from seeing them. Number six also applies to the coops, and there must be at least a minimum of three square feet per hen, which should be pretty easy because you're only allowed to have four in the first place. And lastly, since you do have to feed the chickens, any feed that you have for them kept on the property must be in a container that is secure from predators and rodents. So there are some rules to follow, but the answer is yes, you can't have chickens in Palm Harbor. But before you run out and start picking up chicks, Make sure you check with your homeowners association if you have one, as they may have rules in place that prevent you from keeping chickens on the property, even though the county allows it. If you do live in Pinellas County, but you live in one of our other cities, make sure you check with your local municipality. Most of them have similar laws in place that will allow you to keep chickens on the property, but you should double check the laws for your city to make sure they don't cry foul. Well, that's going to do it for this week's video. Again, I'm Shane Voris with eXp Realty, your local Palm Harbor realtor. Thank you very much for watching this. Click the thumbs up and like the video if you did. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't so you don't miss the next video. And I will see you next week.